day three in the afternoon. Um, had the opportunity to work at the pool in the morning. Met some lovely people. Uh, but now, I'm actually taking a walk around the Japanese markets. Not markets, gardens. Get it right, you. Uh, this place covers about five hectares, they say. And it, uh, it represents the entire landscape of Japan. I know, look at it, isn't it gorgeous? Um, it's also the biggest or the largest Japanese garden in the Southern Hemisphere. There you go. Really worth a visit. It's absolutely stunning. Okay, so just found out that when the Japanese built this garden, they built all the rocks three quarters underneath the ground. So all of these rocks that you can see behind me have been placed around the gardens. And all you are seeing is the tip of the mountain, which is um, very Japanese. So this carp that lives in this water is just below me now. I'll just try to get a shot for you. There you go. Look at that. Hey, fishy fish. That big white one. Oh my God. Yeah, so they live here. They live in this pond. It's just below me. They're all coming up for a bit of a feed. Yeah, they're a, um, a Japanese fish that live in this lake. Nishikiago koi carp and they live in this lake. Look at that. Woo. Well, that's an end of a pretty amazing cow of Japanese gardens. I'll tell you that right now. Look at it. It's still amazing. It keeps giving and giving and giving. There's ducks and beware of snakes and wildlife and birds. It's absolutely beautiful. And I probably had the best scones and jams I've ever had in my life. This place is amazing. Absolutely stunning. I know that mum and dad would have loved to visit this place. I love you mum and dad. Thinking of you. My joy. <laughs>